just want to show you guys how easy it is to um, do some wet distressing. I just have a wet rag here. <laughs> Hopefully you can see this because I don't know how to videotape. Um, but it's just a wet dish rag and I bring I wring out most of the water and I've got a coat of um, Virginia chestnut under this and Trevor City cherry over top. So now I'm just going to take this and wipe back. And I kind of put, kind of wrap it around my finger so I can put just a little bit of more of a pinpoint of where I want to catch the distressing. So I just go along the edges here and bring out some of the corner detail. I just kind of go along around the bottoms, the edges, any detail you want to cut. And you can't see what I'm doing because I'm way over on the side, but it's really, really easy. You don't have to use sandpaper, make a big mess. I'm actually working in my living room right now because it's cold and snowy out and it's a little more convenient to work here than in the garage this time of year in Michigan. So hopefully if you guys have never tried it, you'll see how easy this is. It takes very little pressure to do it. You don't want to have the rig super wet, um, but you'll get the feel of it after you try it. But see how that just kind of gives it that cool aged look to it? So, that's it. That's how easy it is to distress with um, CC Caldwell's paint. And the reason we don't have any um, latex or acrylics in our paint, which makes this really easy to do. You do this before you wax it. So, that's it. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks.